Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to create a flame trail or jet flame inside Cinema 4D using light object. So let's take a look on what we're going to be creating. First, uh, we have this project here, this simple animation, as you can see. I created it using uh, Simo 4D, as you can see. Very simple animation, I've created using Simo 4D, and the, the, lighting, the lighting or the jet flame also created using Simo 4D. So, as you can see, created this one so let's get started we're gonna get started from this project here I put it a link to download this uh, model I'm giving away giving it away for free it's a simple f16 model I've created it by myself so let's get started first of all let's create a light object all right Let's put it inside this uh, the top bean. <coughs> Go to general here, and from the type change the type from omni to parallel spot, and the shadow to shadow map soft. Visible light, change it to visible, and check no illumination. All right. Now let's go to details. Uh, I already animated this uh, this turbine here. It's turbine outer. As you can see, it's moving. It's moving in and out. All right. So we're gonna work on it just like this here. So. Go back to light details change the outer radius to maybe uh, 25 percent 25 percent and go to visibility change the edge for off to 100 percent and the inner distance to maybe 100 and the outer distance change it to 450 alright as you can see we have a, a trail here we're gonna create this one as a nice shiny trail that we have in the JIT flame alright let's uh, change the brightness to 300 and enable use gradient Let's change the gradient to yellow and some yellow light and uh, orange to have that trail that come in from the engine. Far from on from the engine. Oh, sorry. Yes. As you can see. Change this one a little bit white. All right. Now let's go to copy this one. Name it trail. Let's copy it and name it. Name this one base. This one will be the big light that come in from the engine. So clothes from the engine. We're gonna go to details. Change the details of this one to. 32 maybe and uh, let's go to visibility change some details, some details here some options change the inner distance to 70 percent 70 centimeters sorry and the outer distance to from the 300 centimeters 
increase the brightness to 400 and let's change the gradient color to blue because this one is too close from the engine so we need it to be to look blue right just like this change the to 38 maybe a bit bigger in the engine change this one to 28 all right i think it's uh, looks pretty good now as you can see in the animation we have that uh, turbulence movement in the light that make it look uh, realistic a little bit so how we're gonna go how we gonna add that just by uh, selecting these two lights and go to noise from the noise change it to boat because we're gonna need it to the illumination and the visibility to be to have some turbulence movement chose both and from the type change it to wavy turbulence change the, the velocity to zero and the contrast to 100 and the brightness to 50 percent so if you want to animate the turbulence just put these options here and animate the velocity by adding a keyframe here and go for example to frame 60 and increase it to 400 or something like that and a keyframe so when it comes to animation we are not going to see uh, i'm not going to see anything here happening because of this option because it's uh, only shown in the animation when you animate this this uh, video when you render this animation uh, sorry when you render this animation you can see the turbulence movement uh, on the edges of the light so now you're gonna see nothing nothing is happening even if we go closer and render it nothing gonna be nothing but if you animate it and render it and after the rendering of the animation you're gonna see what's happening because of the turbulence I hope you understand so we can add more details to this light by copying this place here hide these two guys this place here as you can see let's go here Go here to this one, change it a little bit, get the visibility and then uh, 200, change the inner distance a little bit and the outer distance and change the color to look like something is burning. Yeah. Something is burning right there. Just a simple idea, not uh, not making something realistic here. So let's enable these two guys. All right, let's change the brightness of this one. 600 to have some 
extra light there it's optional you can add it if you want so animating this uh, this light is not uh, included so you can just animate it using two these two guys here the inner and the outer distance and this one the outer radius you can just animate all these lights using these three options or changing the color will be good too so you're gonna have this uh, model to download in the link in the description I'm giving it for free so this is the end of uh, this tutorial I hope you enjoyed thanks for watching and see you in the upcoming tutorial